Hello everyone! In this short video, I explain how you can simply replace NA values in Pandas data frame with the forward and backward fill method. For that, I just need to import the packages Pandas and NumPy, and then here I create a data frame to show you the two methods. So I just create DF1, and within here, I define NA values as first string and then I replace them as numpy. But you can also just put here a numpy nan value in here. And when we run that, then we get this data frame here, just as example. And you can see here in this small data frame, we have several nan values in the data. And now we want to fill these na values. The first method we are going to use is the ffill, which is is just the forward fill method and here we define df2 as the df1 which is just up here and we use the fill na command with the method ffill and when we run that then we get just this simple data frame and as you can see here we replaced this na value with 1.255 which is just the value up here again so we just forward filled the NA value here and also here we just have an NA value and we then forward filled this 3.558. And the same thing is done in column 3 and 4 and as you see here we had NA values and we just forward filled them with the minus 10 and the 15 from row 1. Then when we want to use the backward fill method, then we just use the same command. We just change the method to backward fill, so b fill. And as you can see down here, we have this new table with the backward fill method. And in this table, you can still see these na values here. But this is just because we backward fill them. Them. So Python has no value down here which we can use to fill this NA value here. And the NAN value up here can be backward filled with the 3.558 as you can see here. And if there is an NA value in the last row, then obviously we cannot backwards fill this NA value with another value which doesn't exist. With this short video, I just wanted to show you how you can replace NA values values with the forward and the backward fill method. If it helped also in your case to get rid of the NA values, please leave a like and subscribe for more. Thanks a lot and see you next time.